Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Doom. In the last episode we've done containment area and now we're going to be moving on to... What's this one called? Refinery. Um, but before we start this level I just want to talk for a second and say that the audio was messed up on the last four episodes and I apologise for that. Um, but these are computers, they do strange things and I spent a long time checking the sound levels and it turns out um, that when I restart the program or even if I just alt and tab it sets all of the sound settings back to normal. So that's why uh, the sound is really high on the last episode and there's actually nothing I can do about that really. So I've had to change the sound settings a different way because if I were to change the audio level of the game it would actually reset as soon as I come back into the game it would put itself back to full which is really unfortunate. Um, and I didn't feel like recording them again because I kind of feel that takes away from the surprise, you know, one of the things about Doom is the way mobs jump out at you. I keep calling them mobs, you know what I mean, these demons, these monsters. Uh, the walls fall down and then usually a load of mobs come at you and that kind of stuff is is good when it happens the first time but when you know it's going to happen it's just not as fun so yeah that's why I decided to keep the original recordings. Let's kill this guy over here and now we can concentrate a little bit on what we're doing. So we've got a couple of caca demons over here, these are going to be easy to dodge and it's taking a fair amount of time with this shotgun to take them down, but they're dead now. So we've got a dead Doom guy down there on the floor. Here we go, health pack, invisibility, that's going to help us. He can still see us though. And then we've got a load of guys in this room over here. Ah, that's the exit of the level. And then what's behind here? Okay, so you can't see me. And I heard... I heard a mob there, I can't remember what type it is. Actually, the audio is quite quiet for me now because I've had to change... Uh, the way the sound is set up, so I'm just going to adjust my headphones. That's much better. Now I can hear it with some volume. And I think I'm actually going to have to reset the recording again. I've got that problem <laughs> with the uh, the frames. It happens on old games, you know, they're just... It's not modern, and the way they work is different. Now we've switched to a different weapon there, if you've noticed. Don't want to waste our ammo on that one. Okay, there we go. Back to 180 frames per second, which is all good. take that guy out. We've got 100% health. We just walked into him as well. Oh, now it did it again. Do not want to waste... <laughs> Let's punch him. Okay. <laughs> Don't know why I did that. It was a bit reckless. As was that. There's a berserker there. We will leave that for now. So there's a chem suit here. Some ammunition. Now I wouldn't mind that. Oh, we can actually grab that. That's cool. Oh, oh, oh. I'm not thinking... Okay, I really would like a shotgun. I've got to be careful here. Nope, that was not good. Let's take that health pack. And a caca demon. Okay, this level's actually going to be a little bit brutal, isn't it? So, we need to keep our wits about us. And we don't really have the right weapon to be dealing with this. Do you know what? I should probably use that plasma gun. <laughs> I never use that. I save up all the ammo for like the final fight. And a time like now would be a good time to use it, but we've We've taken this guy out with the pistol so far, so if we don't get a shotgun soon, then I'll probably start using that weapon a little bit. Oh! <laughs> there we go. In your face. Okay, so there's some shells over here. That's great. 40 shots we've now got. One for you. <laughs> and a chain gun as well. That's good. So we got a nice little array of weapons here. Let's get out of this area. Doesn't seem to be too much in there. Now that chem suit, I reckon we're going to unlock something at some point, and then that's going to be useful. It's usually how these things work. So blue key card door over there. Well, that was a bad shot. Okay, a little room just opened up to the side there. I think that's what that noise was. Oh, the demon. One more shot, and he's dead. Who's shooting at me? I think it's that guy in there, isn't it? Really hard to see with the vines. Okay, let's go into this room. This looks totally different in here. This is a bit twisted, what's going on. Let's get across to the other side. Ah, now this might be what we need the chem suit thing for, so we're going to head back here. If we can get across safely. Right. So we've got the blue door there on our right. We also have another door, doorway even, over here that we haven't explored. And that's that bit there, so we won't go the long way around. We'll grab the chem suit, and then we can go through. There we go. 
I'm not sure if it's actually called a gem suit. <laughs> That's just what I call it. Okay, so let's have a look around us here. There's a health pack, and a shotgun, and a whole bunch of mobs. Let's see if there's anything else in here since we have the chem suit on. It doesn't appear so, does it? Hmm, I might have wasted this. Now, now what I'm tempted to do is to look for another area we can go with the chem suit on so we don't waste it, but... Like here, this is a place. That takes us over to this bit, which gives us one of these guns and some ammunition for it. Let's jump down here and that's probably a bad idea. Let's blow up the barrel. Like that, and again. Oh, that was nicely done, that was. <laughs> that worked out very well. Okay, cool. Oh, one more for you. Health pack, and for you. Okay. I think... Whoa, let's shoot the barrel. Blow up everything in the room. There we go, there we go. Okay. This room doesn't appear to have much in it, except a little bit of ammunition, some health packs. That might be something to remember. We can go back there and get about 40% health. So we walked this way, except we didn't explore what was in this bit. Looks like it just goes around the corner. Back out here again. Okay, I'm just adjusting the volume. Turn it down a tad. That music's a bit loud for me. Oh, hello. <laughs> Where did you come from? You came from the left. I don't think that's something that I walked past. Ah, I think we did actually... No, we've been from there. Okay, cool. So if we head back this way and go the other side, this is another area. Is that psych? Yeah, it is. But let's grab this. That's 200% armor. That is a nice little find. And a secret has been revealed. Uh, we've been to this area before. Ah, but we now have the blue key card. So we can go through this way. Let's have a demon. Let's kill him. Three shots and you're down. Oh, 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 there's quite a few guys in there. Okay, that was nicely dealt with. And it's dark around here. Dark and spooky. Oh, we've got a couple of demons in there. Oh, he went down quickly. Only took two shots. Okay, there's another demon. I think there might be a spectre as well. I did see something move actually no it's probably just the texture from a different uh, from a distance creating yeah that kind of hmm, I forget what they call it um, right shoot that guy oh man blinking lights are the worst <laughs> it's just intense now oh there we go take that <laughs> and again there's one there Another one. I think there's one behind me. Yep, there's two behind me. Great. Turned the wrong way there. There's a health pack. So there's something... Oh no, that's the beginning. And there's some shells there. We'll grab those. So to our left is where we haven't been. Looks good. Okay, all of this is good. Let's grab that ammunition. And get out of that bit there. Ah, now this is something we need a chem suit for, so where can we go? We can go straight across, probably. It looks like we can also go over to the right. Okay, just wanted to check what that was. So we're going to be walking on the uh, poisonous stuff for a long time if we go that way. But that actually appears to be the end of the level. Oh, let's uh, take care of this spectre. Oh, no, no, open the door. Okay, so that was the refinery. We got 33% of the secrets there. I don't think we ever get near 100%, but this is Demios Lab. And this is a dark one to start off with. Right. And my frames are going funny again. Okay, it's good to know we can fix that just by restarting the recording. There's all kinds of problems you have with these old games, um, but it appears there's nothing to do except walk onto this. Okay, these guys haven't seen us yet. Let's take out the shotgun guy first, because we can dodge these guys nice and easy. There we go. Take that and that. <laughs> and do you know what I think? I might have seen a mob I don't like down there. 
Um, if you remember when we played Doom 2, if you watched that series as well, there were... Oh, I walked into that. There were arch de no arch files they're called, and there's a few other mobs like that as well, which are only in Doom 2. And arch files are really difficult to deal with, however, they're not in this game, which makes it slightly easier. Got to say. Um, wasn't there something over here, a health pack? Uh, we don't need to take that just yet. This looks kind of suspicious. How do we get in here? I don't know, but there is... I thought that was a key card, because sometimes they're skulls. That might be a Doom 2 thing as well, actually, but there you go. That's not something we can pick up. Let's go back down and go this way. That appears to be the only path. However, this is probably just going to... Yeah, it's just going to take us back there. Okay. Right, so... Oh! Let's take this guy out. Oh! Damn it! <laughs> Right, just got to figure out what's going on over here. That, I'm not sure if that's safe over there to the side. But we can actually sprint across that. Take refuge on this middle bit. Now this would be an interesting level design. Wherever you go from bit to bit, you have to walk across uh, the poisonous stuff. Because then, you know, your travelling is going to equate to you taking damage, which isn't particularly great. Oh, here we go. Dark area. Hmm. Not much... What's going on? Oh, hello. <laughs> oh, there's quite a few guys back here. Let's oh, take out the demon. Two shots and he's down that time. I think that's because it's close range. So we've got a caca demon. Oh man, I'm getting messed up because this guy's behind me. Let's take this health pack. I think there's another guy here. Yep. Right, so how are we going to deal with this caca demon? Let's get rid of the imp first. And you know what? Change weapons. That's how we're going to deal with it. There we go, and he's down. Got to remember to do that more often, although, in fairness, we've mostly been dealing with imps and shotgun guys and stuff so far, so there must be a button around here somewhere. Okay, that just started changing. What's up with that? It's trying to crush us. How do we get out of here? Um. Ah, here we go. And that will let us out. That's good. Right, let's continue. So we came from that way. So we continue down here. Man, this place is quite different from what we've seen so far. Let's go through this door first of all. Oh man. <laughs> it's time to fight one of these guys. Let's change our weapon to the chain gun. That makes it nice and easy. Actually, do you know what? This guy is kind of scary, but on his own, he's really easy to fight. It does take some time to kill him though. Let's get the right weapon selected. Not a chainsaw. There we go, shotgun. Okay. Up we go. Blue key card, that's good. Let's hit the switch there and we can go down to our left and look at these heads right here. I call those the Medusa heads. And uh, not actually what Medusa looks like, I guess. Although you wouldn't know because you'd turn to stone if you looked at her. Um, but yeah, I saw that earlier, so I'm going to guess that that takes us back that way, so we're not going to go there. Right, we've got to be careful here. Let's go all the way. <laughs> that was easy. Oh, Cacodemon. Change weapon. Now this guy's going to be easy to deal with. There we go. Nicely done. Anything down here? Okay, it's the Medusa heads again. So we don't need to worry about that. Let's go across. And do we want the chem suit? I think our only way out of here is to drop down. So yes would probably be the answer. We can press that. No, we can't. And let's sprint around here because this is just going to be yep everywhere we've been so far. And then that takes us back from the other side of that room. And then this goes back there. Okay, that's cool. So I know where all of those go now. Um, so where is the blue keycard door? don't remember passing it. Or was it back at the beginning? I think it might have been back at the beginning. No, I've got a feeling there wasn't actually anything up here. Oh well, we'll go up and find out. No, there was just that wasn't there. Uh, let's actually use the mini-map. Okay, so it looks like there's something around here we haven't gone and explored yet. And that is over to our right. Over here, there we go. Ah, this must be the way. Oh, that's kind of a trap. 
no. There's too many of them. I can't break free. Oh, come on. Let me out of here. Oh, damn it. <laughs> oh, and there's spectres as well. And now I've lost. Let's retreat. And again. Oh, man. That messed me up big time. Oh. <laughs> Taking tons of damage. Now I don't even know it was over there. It's going to waste a load of health to get back. Let's go up here. Hit that button. And there's some health packs up here, so we can kind of get a health pack. We've still got a bleh, almost 100% armor, so it's not all too bad. Actually, the health packs are behind there, so I'm going to have to deal with it, I guess. Right, let's sprint across. Oh, that was silly. This way. Okay, there's a health pack. A few more of these guys to take care of. Nicely done. And now we can grab all of this stuff. Ah, there's another chem suit as well, so we can go and use that and find out wherever the blue door is. Okay, now we've got some sort of visibility thing as well. We've got a couple of extra shells. Okay, so where do we go? Um, That's kind of all of that area done, isn't it? Although it looks like there's actually something behind us. Let's sprint over there and have a look quickly. What's behind this door right there. Nothing. I don't know why it has a different colour on the mini-map. Alright, so over here there is actually something to our right that we missed out on. There we go. This is a secret area. Let's grab all of this stuff. More ammo for the chain gun. And I can see the blue door on the map, so if we go this way, then... Oh yeah, this divided up round here, didn't it? I went that way and I didn't go this way. And so up here is the blue door. There's some uh, ammo. And there's probably going to be... Yep. Oh, a whole group of them. I knew there'd be something behind the corner. Nicely done. There we go. Okay, so what's around to the side here? Cacodemon. Let's change weapon. And that is nice and easy. There's an ammo pack there. We've already got one of those, I think. I'm not sure if that's going to upgrade the amount of ammo we can hold again. Make sure we've got the right weapon selected. Ah, this is very, <laughs> very different. Okay, yellow key card is... Ooh. Oh! Oh! <laughs> I didn't press the sprint key in time. Ah, oh, that caught me out, that did. Evil, what a trap. I guess we can go through here now. Oh, I'm really expecting something to jump out of me now. <laughs> That'd be so typical. Can we go through here? We can, and it drops down. And there's still nothing. Where are they? There they are. Oh man, I bet they're going to come out of all sides now. Oh, let's change weapon. Because we've got a cacodemon around this side. Take that, let's keep moving as well. Yep, yeah, there's another one. I could hear something else firing at me. Oh, oh, I ran out of ammo. That weapon owned them. Okay, I think that's all of them in here gone. It is. What's that do? Is that anything? Looks like it might be psychic. Oh, there's another little pit of imps. <laughs> okay, this won't take long. One more. Ah, damn it. Go away. There we go. Press the button. I don't know what that does. That lowers that down. Okay, that's good to know. Let's check out what was in the middle because I saw another switch over here. And it makes this rise up. And then I guess that will make the next one rise up. And what's the betting there'll be another one? There is. And so this is how we get out of here. Now there's some of these guys to deal with. And another cacodemon. There we go. That was a uh, good use of ammunition there. Didn't want to overdo it. Oh, I think standing on that set sign off somewhere. I heard... Something move. Anyway, let's go back round. That seems like all there is to see there. Ah, now this looks like something new. Oh, that's a bit twisted. <laughs> all the faces. It's like soul sand. All the different souls. Ah, take that. <laughs> ah, that is the end of the level. However, look what's going on here. And there's a portal over there. There's something behind there, I think. Okay, that's a power-up, not a mob. And possibly another way out over there. So we're going to sprint to this. 
That's going to take us back there. So the other option is to go over here. There's that to press, which raises that, and then this must take us back over here. And then that is the level done. I think. <laughs> I hope so. That should be it. Yep, I was ready for that. <laughs> there we go. So that is another level done. As always, thank you very much for watching, and I'll catch you next time.